an ultimate team. Have you ever packed Messi? Have you ever packed Ronaldo? No? Me neither. But they're both of my ultimate team. How? Easy. Because I went to buyultimateteam.com and got the coins I needed to get the players I wanted. And you should do the same. Make sure you use the code Curtis for 10% off. What's going on YouTube, Curtis7 here for episode number 18 of my Manchester United crew. Today lads, we've got the last three games of the whole season. Today is the day lads, whether we find out if we've been sacked or whether we keep our job or not. Today lads, we've got Crystal Palace away, Arsenal at home and then Hull City. The other three games we're going to attack today. Hopefully lads, we get to keep our job and we roll on for next season. The first game is against Crystal Palace. Ah, there's Mal Yelenak, the Australian captain. Salhurst Park. Zaha is on loan. Lads, I can't wait to get him back next season. I will definitely want to use him. Do you guys want to use him? Or should I sell him? I don't know. Get your comments down below. But to be honest, I think I'd like to use him. But it's not my career mode. It's our career mode. All right, let's go. Come on, United. Look at this. Rooney. Can he find Angel Di Maria? He can. Step over. Angel Di Maria. Di Maria. Oh, what a save by Price. That was so close. Maybe I should have just hit that first time. Put in Adnan. Adnan Yenizé. We know how dangerous he is this season. Look at him. Skips past one. Skips past another. Adnan Yenizé. Oh, what a save. Robin Van Persie gets in. 1-0 up. From the brilliance of Adnan Yenizai. I just can't talk highly enough about Adnan. I know I'm repeating myself a hundred times this season. But Adnan Yenizai, my word, this kid going to be a superstar. Mind you, Robert Van Persie is deadly as well. So, let's get back, get back, track back. So, oh, now he's ripped me. Look at this, Phil Jones. Oh, what a tackle from Phil Jones. That will probably be a contender for tackle of the season. If there's ever such a thing, but it, that would win it if there was one. <laughs> oh no, Williams got some space in the box there. And look at that, Phil Jones again. Phil Jones, oh no. Williams in the box. Where is everyone? Mo Yeranak. The captain of Crystal Palace. Captain of Australia. Ah, oh, come on, Dave. You can do better than that. You've been so superb for us this season. Ah, unlucky. Oh, what a ball. Zaha's in. Tell you what, they've ripped me to shreds here. Zaha! Oh, Chris Smalling. Another play that's been solid for us this season. Oh, what a pass from Herrera. Come on. Oh, Di Maria's too quick. Got to take the ball with him. And how Di Maria, look at the space now. Can he pick out? Look at that. Adnan Yanize. He can even score with his head. What a goal from Adnan. I tell you what, I thought you were stuffed this up for a second. Lovely cross from... Um, De Maria there, but Adnan Yanize with his head. Look at that diving header. Two might I add. Look at that diving header from Adnan. Adnan's becoming the complete player. Very Ronaldo-esque. Anyways, we go up 2-1. Oh, yes. Record that shit. Di Maria off the kickoff. I've never scored from the kickoff this season. Only with Fellaini. But I tell you what. I can do it again. Oh, Di Maria from the kickoff. If you don't mind. That is the second time that I've scored from the kickoff this season. The one other time that I did manage to do it. It was with Marilyn Fellaini for the winner. If you remember that game a few episodes ago. So uh, that's a weird class to have. <laughs> Good goal though. Di Maria finds Rooney. Well done, lad. Well done. Look at this, Robin Van Persie. Can he stay onside? Please be onside. Robin with the chip. Robin Van Persie! Goal of the season, contender. I am on song for FIFA 15 with my chips. Yes, Doritos, Smiths, any brand you want, I can chip it. My word, Robert Van Persie scores a goal of the season contender. Is that better than Adnan's and Falcao's? All the players are getting in on the active season. My word, that is definitely a contender. I think that can beat the others, lads. That is a marvelous chip from Robin Van Persie. Oh, man. 
What a goal from Robin. Oh, Robin Van Persie. How's he kept this? They're going to catch him. Just shoot. Oh, my word. Is it the crossbar? I was hoping just to win a corner or something. Mate, they had no right to be anywhere near the goals. Oh, imagine if they had a win in. There we go, lads. The referee blows the whistle for full time. What a great display today. We've picked up three points, lads. And we've pretty much qualified for the Champions League next year. What an effort. If you remember the last episode, lads, we got a message from Raphael. He said he wants to leave Man United. He wants to leave England altogether. He's not happy with the place. But I was reading one of the comments down below and it made sense. And yes, I do read the comments down below. You guys probably noticed I do talk back to a lot of my subscribers. And uh, one young chap said, why don't you offer a contract that uh, Raphael can, can't re uh, resist, you know? So I thought that's a great idea. So as you can see there, he's on 80 grand a week. I love Raphael. I want to keep him. I reckon if we put him to three figures, we make him £110,000 a week. I know it's a lot more than I should be paying for him. £110,000 a week, crucial first team player, and uh, give him a 5% uh, clean. Nah, no, we won't give him that. Uh, crucial player, maybe he'll go and accept that. And uh, let's see how it works. And would you look at that. The title of this message, I'm happy to stay boss. Yes, Raphael. I'm not sure whether I'll ever be able to feel at home here, but I want to give it a try. Everyone at Manchester United has worked really hard to help me forget to feel part of the club, and I want to repay the faith I can. It's true, I don't like the country, but I'm not willing to walk away until I'm given everything that I've got. Yes, Raphael is going to stay Thank you, Rafa. In the next game, lads, we have Arsenal at Old Trafford. Always a big, feisty game, this one. United yeah, no, against Arsenal. Come on. Let's be having ya. Arsenal against United is always one of my favourite games of the season, especially in recent years. Now that Robin Van Persie switched over. But uh, now this year, I can't wait for it as well. Danny Wilbeck plays for Arsenal. It's going to be fantastic. All right. Come on, United. We owe Arsenal one. They beat us last time around. Let's go. Smalling. To Rooney. Look at this. And Herrera. Herrera. Tell you what. He's gotten past a few of them. And Herrera takes the shot. It's the crossbar. Oh, gosh. Could have been up 1-0 right there. Strootman. Strootman. He's got a panic here. Pulls it up to Di Maria. He's got the speed. Sees Robert Van Persie. Robert Van Persie. Oh, good shape from Good save from Chesney there. Good save. That's a tongue twister. Good save from Chesney there. So that 10 times in a row. Good save from Chesney. 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 <laughs> Strootman finds De Maria. De Maria. And Nanyanaze just can't get in. We just cannot get in. Good tackle. That was a great tackle. Thank you, referee. Thought he was going to pay a foul there. Rooney gets tackled. Murder Saka out of position. Sees. Oh, Rooney. Oh. Luke Shaw sees Robert Van Persie on the volley. Traditional Robert Van Persie with their header from the World Cup. The Flying Dutchman, they say. Van Persie. Van Robert Van Persie. Hey, referee. That was naughty. Still got the ball. Want the free kick. Surely that's a yellow ticket. Thank you. Robin Van Persie to take the free kick against his old club. Can he put it back in the old onion bag? Nah, not really. Not on that occasion anyways. <laughs> Herrera finds Adnan. Tell you what, he's got murder sucker to beat. That should be easy. Oh, Adnan, yeah, that's it. Adnan! This is the greatest company in the world! Nah, bruh. Nah. Nah, no way. He has just gone and done it again. On that right wing, Hernan Yanaze is just a monster. He is an absolute beast. I just can't tell you how good this kid is. If you're doing a career mode, get Adnan Yanaze. He is an absolute gem. Ozil on the ball. Ozil. Ramsey, Ramsey, he's got in between. Oh, great save from Spanish Dave. The keeper that never shaves. <laughs> Just made that up. But yeah, great save. 
Oh, Wilcott's on the ball, that's why. Here we go. Ozil puts in a lovely ball. And Nanyeneze defending as well. What is going on? <laughs> this kid can do it all. But it's come out to Flamini. Dumbia. Dumbia. Oh, top finish. Nothing I can do about that. Dumbia starts ahead of Giroud and Danny Wilberg. And uh, we're finishing like that. You can see why. 1-1. One, one. Strootman. 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 He's holding off. Referee. Tell you what. Strootman. Herrera. Look at this. Adnan Yanaze. Adnan. Can he get it back? Adnan. Oh. <laughs> yes, he didn't score himself. But he was the one that created that goal as it goes in off Mertesacker. Just gone and tried to... Well, it's hit him straight in the guts, hasn't it? And, um, yeah, mate. Adnan Yanaze. Where would we be without you, my friend? My word. Adnan Yanaze. You, my friends, got no words to describe that. I've run out of words. Can you believe that? Oh, it's not a murder sacker own goal. It's an Adnan Yanaze goal. He's on a hat trick. <laughs> oh, it's coming out to Robert Van Persie. Robert Van Persie sees Adnan for his hat trick. Oh, I've been a bit selfish there. There we go, lads. Picked up all three points against Arsenal. And now, I think, lads, we should have jumped Arsenal and probably gone into third on the table. Anyways, lads, on to the next game. All right, lads, so here we go. Got a message from the board, and they want to talk about my performance. And they say, Curtis Seven, on behalf of the board, I want to acknowledge all the work and dedication we've seen you bring to the club. We know you've had a lot of pressure and speculation of the club, and we want to reassure you that we are behind you to carry forward the Manchester United legacy. Yes, lads, we didn't get sacked. We made top four. Bring on season two, get in. So here we go guys at the KC Stadium on the last day of the season. And if my memory serves me correct, we've played Hull City in the last game of the season in 2009, 2008. We made the Champions League final and all, pretty much all our reserves played. I think Nani scored that day too, if I'm not correct. But um, yeah, there's a little bit of history for you. <laughs> all right, let's go. Come on, United. Al Mohamedi whips the ball in. Tell you what's coming out the back. Raphael's all over. That's the new man. The man staying with us, lads. Raphael. <laughs> Feels good to say that. Defense. The tail. Rooney sees Van Persie. Oh, look at this. Yanazai. Come on, stay on that. All right, Yanazai's got about five to beat here. But I tell you what, I would back him every day of the week. Adnan. 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 Adnan still on the ball. Oh. <laughs> Raphael, well done. Oh, he's putting a ball for Adnan. Use your speed, Yanazai. Look at this. He sees Van Persie at the back post. Oh, poor I scored, Robin. I know I was with his right foot, but I tell you what, you shouldn't be missing those. Gaston Ramirez. Oh, he finds Sagbo. 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 1 0, Hull City. I don't believe this. I can't believe they just scored from that. We were just open like no tomorrow at their back. Oh my word, let's get it together. Oh no, they're in again. Aluko, what a touch. How do you get that? Ah, oh, it's a corner. Come on, let's get it together. Oh no. No, why did I clear it like that for? Should have just pressed the X button. 2 0, that was my fault. My fault. Oh, it's so frustrating. Got a bad habit when I try to clear it. I try to pass it out of defense instead of just belting the ball out of the way. Ah, oh, my fault. That is genuinely my fault. Di Maria gets around the back, gets inside. And how Di Maria, Di Maria, someone at the back post. It's Adnan. Adnan Yenizet hits the crossbar, comes back out. Oh, you don't get much closer than that, do you, Rooney? To Yanazai. Adnan on the other wing this time. Switched wings. Adnan Yanazai. Who's in there? All on his own. Adnan. Oh. Alright. Adnan. What can you do, lad? Can you save us again? What a turn. Adnan. Deflection. Oh. How close do you want to get? There we go, lads. Yes, we didn't win the game, but we did make top four. That's our achievement for this season. I am more than happy with that. 
get in, let's check out the league table and all the stats. So as you can see there, lads, we finished in fourth spot. Unlucky not to finish second, but what do you do? Top four was our aim from the get-go, and we made top four. I think that deserves a round of applause. Well done, lads. We did it together. Next season, we'll be back in the Champions League, where we belong. I can't wait for it. We're going to get some players now. But as you can see there, lads, uh, Chelsea are top of the table there. They romped it away, and I think they'll do that in real life this season, to be honest. But in saying that, lads, Arsenal finished second, and then Liverpool one point behind them, and we were only one point behind Liverpool. So... There we go, lads. Tottenham finishing in fifth spot, as they always do. And the biggest surprise of them all, lads, was Man City. They finished in sixth spot. Unbelievable. As you can see there, lads, we had 22 wins, 9 draws, and 7 losses. That's pretty good. We scored 56 goals, 33 against, and a goal difference of 23. And we finished with 75 points. One thing I want to bring up, lads, was our goals against. We were the third best in the whole league. So our defense must be doing something right. So uh, I don't think we need too, too many changes to our defenders. Maybe just one central defender. Who knows? And as we check out relegation, Hull City, Burnley and Leicester City will all go into the championship. Anyways, lads, that's going to come to the end of this episode. But technically, the season's not over yet, lads. We still have voting left to do for the goal of the season, player of the season. We're still going to see the squad report, how that ended, lads. So make sure this week, lads, there's going to be a few episodes coming out about this season. Great videos. And hopefully next week, lads, we shall start season two. But until then, lads, I'm your boy, Curtis7. Please like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter and Facebook and all those wonderful things. Don't forget to check out buyultimateteam.com as well. Automated and 100% reliable. I'm your boy, Curtis7. Take care and peace.